good morning class in today's english class we will be starting with the chapter conjunctions conjunction are words that link other words phrases or clause together so children if we start with what are conjunctions then conjunctions are words that link other words other words words you already know there are so many words and if you want to join two similar type of words you can use conjunctions it can even link phrases what are phrases phrases are the incomplete sentences or maybe the part of a sentence that is not having a subject or a predicate and what are clauses clauses are a sentence maybe a part of a sentence that is having a subject and a predicate सो so, कंजंक्शन से क्या काम होता है ये दो वर्ड्स को दो या दो से ज़्यादा शब्दों को और मे बी अ सेंटेंस विद एन अदर सेंटेंस अ फ्रेज विद अ सेंटेंस इनको जॉइन करने का काम करता है सो कंजंक्शंस आर आल्सो नोन एज कनेक्टर्स और जॉइनिंग वर्ड्स कंजंक्शंस अलाउ यू टू फॉर्म कॉम्प्लेक्स एलिगेंट सेंटेंसेज एंड अवॉइड मल्टीपल शॉर्ट सेंटेंसेज multiple short sentences like many times while writing we write like i like sweets i like toffees and then you say i don't like cakes so if we are joining them then we can even frame a single sentence using conjunctions so ye teen chote chote sentence likhne ke bajaye hum ek sentence likh सकते हैं बाय यूजिंग कंजंक्शंस लाइक आई लाइक स्वीट्स एंड टॉफीज बट आई डोंट लाइक केक्स सो एन एंड बट ये कंजंक्शंस हैं यूजिंग देम वी हैव मेड वन कॉम्प्लेक्स सेंटेंस एंड वी हैव अवॉइडेड मल्टीपल शॉर्ट सेंटेंसेस राइट नाउ कमिंग टू सम अदर एग्जांपल्स फर्स्ट वन सेज लुक एट दिया एंड सिया We went to Nainital and had a great time. Tina will not go to school tomorrow because she is not well. Tanu is short, but Ria is tall. He lost the match although he worked hard. So all the words that are written in red, they are what they are conjunctions. Like if we take the first sentence, इससे हम दो छोटी sentences लिख सकते थे. Look at Dia. look at sia now rather than repeating those words look at we have use conjunction look at the and sia similarly in the second one we went to nainital we had a great time so do sentences ko combine humne kisse kiya by using conjunction and we went to nainital and had a great time similarly in the third one tia will not go to school tomorrow tia is not well so tia will not go to school tomorrow because she is not well tanu is short ria is tall these are two sentences we have combined them using conjunction but tanu is short but ria is tall he lost the match this is one sentence he worked hard another sentence so we have joined them using the conjunction although he lost the match although he worked hard so the words like and because but although they all are conjunctions now we will learn the use of conjunctions now children there are so many conjunctions like and or if although though so where to use what kahan pe kis cheez ka use hona hai that knowledge you should have so now let's start first one is and and is shows addition and is used when the statements are similar or equal so and shows addition and shows addition means hum and ka use kahan karte hain jab two sentences similar hain right like i shall go to the market i shall bring you colors so that means two things are connected with me 
so i am using conjunction and i shall go to the market and bring you colors she grows watermelon and muskmelon because both are related with growing so she grows watermelon and muskmelon i am neha i like pet these are two sentences i have combined them using and i am neha and i like pet animals clear so and ka use hum wahan pe karenge jab do statements ek jaisi hain theek hai that means ek jaisi in the sense they are talking about the similar things right now using but however yet and in spite of these joint statements that express opposite ideas that is used to present a contrast or exceptions in ideas and ka use kaha kiya tha when the two ideas were similar when the two statements were similar now where to use but yet in spite of or however when the two sentences or the two ideas are opposite like i eat cake i never eat biscuits so first sentence to positive hai dusri negative hai so we are putting them together by but i eat cake but i never eat biscuits i went to school in spite of not being well so it's a contrasting statement means though i was not well still i went to school rohan worked hard yet he did not pass the exam so it's a contrasting statement he worked hard usne mehnat kari to usse pass ho dan ho jana chahiye tha lekin wo nahi hua so yet he did not pass the exam i wrote for 10 hours however i did i did not or i didn't finish my composition that means it's a contrasting statement i worked for 10 hours main to 10 ghante lagaye फिर भी या लेकिन मेरा काम नहीं हुआ सो हाव एवर आई डेंट फिनिश माई कॉम्पोजिशन सो वर्ड्स लाइक बट येट इन स्पाइट ऑफ एंड हाव एवर दीज आर द कंजंक्शंस दैट आर यूज टू एक्सप्रेस अपोजिट आइडियाज और और वी यूज और बिफोर एन ऑल्टरनेटिव In other words, it is used to present an alternative item or idea. जब आपके पास options होंगे choose करने के लिए this or that, either choose red pen or blue pen. Write with red pen or blue pen. So every day that eat, they eat toffees or chocolates. So or is used to show choice option, and it is used before an alternative. जैसे ऑल्टरनेट क्या है टॉफी है टॉफी का ऑल्टरनेट क्या दिया गया है चॉकलेट या तो टॉफी होगी या चॉकलेट होगा सो ऑल्टरनेट्स होंगे वर्क हार्ड और यू विल फेल इन द एग्जाम सो इज एन ऑल्टरनेट वर्क हार्ड और यू विल फेल इन द एग्जाम ठीक है अदरवाइज वी यूज अदरवाइज टू इंट्रोड्यूस द पॉसिबल आउटकम ऑफ अ गिवन सिचुएशन or we can say that it is used to express that if one thing does not happen something else usually bad will happen so otherwise ka use kaha karte hain to show the possible outcome like generally how we speak we say that agar aisa nahi kiya to aisa ho jayega so that in that case we are using otherwise like generally if we are telling somebody to do something and if that thing does not happen then whatever is the result that is connected by using word otherwise like they must hurry up otherwise they will miss the bus so they must hurry up iska outcome kya niklega agar wo jaldi nahi karenge they will miss the bus so we are using otherwise to introduce the possible outcome of the given situation we he must prepare well otherwise he will not clear the interview theek hai to kisi situation ka outcome dikhane ke liye we are using otherwise so and therefore 
we use so or therefore to show result or consequences of something. Consequence means result. John was very hungry. So, he ate all the cookies. So or therefore का use कहाँ होगा? किसी चीज़ का result दिखाने के लिए. Right? इसका outcome क्या होगा? I am a vegetarian, so I don't eat any chicken. Junk food is not good for health, therefore we should avoid it. Now see, otherwise be consequence या result दिखा रहा था. But generally, वहाँ पे situation का result दिख रहा है. But in otherwise, it is mostly negative या opposite दिख रहा है. But in so and therefore, it is nothing like positive or negative. Then coming to because, as and since, we use these to provide reason for an action. Aapne aisa kiya, kyun kiya? So to show that kyun, we are using because, as and since. I stayed home because it rained heavily. There is a reason for staying at home. I cannot go to school because I am not well. As I am an honest person, I am against bribe. So why I am against bribe? There is a reason. I am an honest person. So you have used as. Since there is no work in the office, we can all go home. So why we can all go home? There is a reason because there is no work in home office. So... Words like because, as and since, these provide reason for an action. So, वहाँ पे हम इसको use करेंगे. Coming to though and although. We use although or though to show contrast in ideas. Contrasting. Although the car was destroyed, nobody was injured in the incident, accident. So, there is a contrast in the idea. Car was destroyed. In the accident. So, generally it is what ki car agar puri destroy ho gai, to sab ko injury aai ho gai. But there is a contrast. The car to destroy ho gai, but nobody was injured. So, although the car destroyed, nobody was injured in the accident. She could not clear the test, though she tried her best. Right? So, there is a contrast that she could not clear the test. Though she tried her best. Usne to apni puri mehnat kari. Lekin phir bhi interview clear nahi hua. So, words or the conjunctions like though and although show contrast in ideas. So, let's have a quick review. Joining words are called conjunctions. And, or, but, because and so are also called conjunctions. Use and. And ka use ka karenge to connect similar ideas. Use but to connect contrasting ideas. Use because to show the reason. So to show the effect. And or to show choices. Right? So children basically conjunctions. There can be some conjunctions that you can use in more than one place. Right? So whatever suits that sentence. You have to use that. Now, let's try. Choose the correct conjunction. Conjunctions are given in the bracket. You have to choose the right one. I like curd. Dash butter. And or but. You can have cake. Dash chips. But. Oblique or. She was crying. Because or so she had fallen. He was tired. Dash, he slept early, but as they tried to cook, Dash were unsuccessful and or but. Now you have to read the sentence, try to understand what the sentence is trying to say and then accordingly you have to choose the conjunction. Basic idea of conjunctions we have already understood where to use what. So these are the answers. I like curd and butter. But ka use nahi karenge. The reason is there is nothing like contrasting statements. You can have cake or chips because we are giving options or alternative. She was crying. 
we are showing reason because she had fallen he was tired <coughs> so he slept early again there is a reason they tried to cook but were unsuccessful so here there is what contrast is there and it is showing what it is showing an outcome so these are the answers of those questions so children just try to understand the usage of conjunctions and practice them thank you